Welcome to Twisted League episode 4. From now on I'm going to try and upload one Twisted League video and one only Trails video every single week. This Wednesday you can expect the big Crystal Imp only Trails episode. So I hope you're excited for that, and I hope you're also excited for this episode. Enjoy. Alright, first big XP drop coming in 80 Golanova fruit. I don't want you guys to judge the 20 I wasted, okay? I, I fucked up. I don't want to talk about it. Oh wait, I got still got four here. You know what? Fuck it. First XP drop, 33k, up to 44 farming. Let's get it. 40 farming, also a league task, by the way. I'm only going to claim the points when we're done with this farming grind, so we'll see how many we get. Next XP drop is gonna get me to 51, is my guess. Damn it. Just about 50. We can now grow Aventos, though. Holy shit, this is going quick. Very nice. What level is the other seed? 54. Okay, that's one more. One more Golanova. Next XP drop incoming. Hopefully 54, so we can use the Bologna fruit. If it's 53, I'm gonna be pissed. <sighs> oh, just about 64. All right. Uh, 11 more levels to go. This is the last tide farm I'm gonna do for the day, because I'm just tired of the minigame to be at. 105k? Excuse me? Oh yeah, I thought I was gonna hit 59. Okay, 65 is gonna have to wait for a little bit. I'm gonna go for base 40s for a little bit, because I've been doing tide farm for a good two hours. So I'm gonna chill for a bit. Try and get room crafting to 30, uh, 40. Uh, what else? Hunting, herb lore, and that is it. Unsmithing. Okay, three skills to do. Right, we've decided to finish up the uh, Archaeus quest because that gives hunter and room crafting XP. And so that is the start of us getting base 40 stats right now. Boom. What room crafting? Three room crafting levels. Holy shit. 37 hunter. That is only three more. We can now do kebits, which are not in Zaya, I think. Favor certificate, I guess. We already had 100% anyways, but... So I forgot I told you guys that I was gonna go for top page crafting. Um, and I was gonna do my 79 to 80 thieving on gem stalls. Kinda came back on that decision, but might as well start cutting my gems. I have a lot of them. I don't know if it'll get me to top page crafting, but we might as well give it a shot, right? We have a lot of sapphires and emeralds. Let's see where we get. Hopefully we get 60 crafting, I'll be happy with that. We are starting at 45 right now. Let's see where we end up. I think this might be the last crafting level, and I might have overestimated the sapphires a little bit. Gem stalls are not worth it when you're high crafting already, because they'll only get you to 56 crafting. Uh, the chances you get something else in a sapphire is relatively low, and so I'm lucky I have not wasted my time too much with them. 56 farming, uh, crafting though, which is not the worst, but certainly not the best. We did not get top page today, we'll have to figure out another way. That rhymed. Bars, boys. And we've started smithing all the way to 40. We are already 36 by just smelting the steel bars and now making arrow tips so we can get some extra fletching levels for the steel arrows. Probably the first useful arrows we can make, because iron and bronze aren't that great. Just about gonna hit 40 with two more remaining. Oh shit, we're Windows Sound, I do apologize. Apparently greater necreoles are the best way to obtain golden bars in general, so that's... We are a bit off from that. Greater necreoles are 80 Slayer. So we're far from that, so I think we have to put crafting on the back burner for a little bit. Either way, let's get this room crafting up to 40, and this hunting. Having a little go at this aerial fishing thing, because I want to get my hunter up to 40, and look at all the XP on the side, it's actually insane. Hunting is about to hit 40 right now. And I don't know if we can do something else then, but I think I might stay here for a little bit. I don't mind it too much. Quite enjoying myself. And yeah, maybe we get lucky. Maybe we get the golden tench. One of the 20k, maybe. Who knows? There it is. 50 hunting. I'm just gonna go straight for um, 54 or 55. I don't know which one it is exactly for the chinchampas, and then I'm out of here. Just got 53. 15 mulch pearls. I'm gonna keep those. Got an elite clue and an easy clue again. So, uh, ready for the chins? I'm not gonna do that right now. The thing we're gonna do right now is these two clues, and then room crafting. No, it happened. It happened. I got the only step that I can do. Mystic Row Bottom is only Alchemical Hydra or Dragon and Blink. So I'm not even gonna try and grind that. Sorry, Mr. Elite. Ah, oh, that hurts so much, considering I am looking for those on my other account. I would love to grind that. Fact of the matter is, I can do that step on my other account. Ah, anyway, shit. Easy clue casket, I'm gonna be very, very pissed if it's the Bob shirt now. Oh my god. On to room crafting. The last skill we need 40 of. And herb lore, but I have that banked, so that's not really an issue. Time for a XP gasm. A lot of room crafting books, here we go. Oh, sweet. Sweet XP. This is absolutely beautiful. I don't know. We start at 24, I guess, right? And I want to get up to 40, so I have no idea what the plan is here. 
I'm guessing we're 26 now. Wait, can I actually spam him? Oh, okay. Good, 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 good. 33 already? Hang on. What? All right. Uh, that was a bunch of levels. Only seven more to go. Oh, you're kidding me. This is not the Hosidius one, right? I just dropped this one on accident. All right, anyways, let's bank these runecrafting XPs. Come on. Give me all of that. Give me all of that. I don't know how many I still need to do. I've got a ton of books, though, so I'm probably going to be doing another run. Just to be sure. But I think I might have reached it. Oh, no. 38. Okay. One more run to go. Let's see if this is enough for 40 runecrafting. Please, baby. Yes, there we go. I didn't want to do any more. So I think I've been here for probably a good hour. Probably a good hour. That's not bad. We are soon going to be able to get that 100 library books, but that's not something for now. Let's get our tasks. Boom. And keep going. Last thing, herb lore. Time to bank this herb lore. Um, I don't know how many good herbs I actually have. I don't think I have enough limpards. I should have been planting limpards. I'm an idiot. How many do I have? Three. Sick. Yeah, that's not great. That was my... That's a mistake on my part. I uh, should have planted them. And then I would have been able to do all my Terramins. And now, I am stuck with three. And because I'm hashtag prayer gang, these Harlander potions, we can turn into energy potions, which are absolutely amazing. Holy shit. Now, this 40 herb lore is going to be a little bit more difficult than I initially expected just because I thought I had limpert roots. So that is a bit of a miscalculation on my part. We did get 35 though, and we still have a couple. Not enough chocolates though, let me get some. Here we go, I think we might have enough now. That is 39, no 38, shit. Okay, prayer pots unlocked, don't have snape grass yet though. We might be able to pick that up somewhere, I'm not sure. The moment of truth, all base 40 stats, unless I looked over something, but I don't think I did. I did not. 40 herblore, 40 base stats. We can now clean irrits. We have a couple. Might as well go for 41 herblore while we add it. Herblore, not lowest skill. It's obviously runecrafting and smithing. So let's take those out. Boom, that's another 90 points. I think it was. I'm not sure. I have gotten myself an Ancow Slayer task. Why, you ask? Well, because one, I'm going to train my magic up to 55 and I can just blast out these Ancows with, at the moment, Earth Bolt, but I'm probably going to buy myself some Chaos Runes and do Fire Bolt in a bit. And, most importantly, these Ancows actually have a 1 out of 512 drop rate of Heart Clues. Not impressive, you say? Well, we have that Treasure Hunter Relic, which makes a 1 out of 512 a 1 out of 10 clue drop. So I'm expecting a lot of Heart Clues from these Ancows. And I am so incredibly ready to start grinding them out. What is even better about that is that we're going to get a shit ton of hard clues. So the magic training is basically going to be sustaining itself. Because those hard clues do have a lot of alkables that will actually make me a shit ton of money the moment I have 55 magic. It's a plan, boys. It's a plan. I swear. And there's the first one. The first clue scroll is already in. Beautiful. We're just gonna chain them after this task is done, I think. I just about missed it because I had to teleport out with 5 HP, but I have 55 magic right now. I think I killed about, I want to say, 12 ant cows. Got two clue scrolls already. This is big. I'm quickly going to open this brimstone key. We gotten four heart clues. I just got myself another Ankow task because I'm not done. I need a couple more death runes and blood runes for some future spell casting. So I'm just going to do a couple Ankow tasks because they're actually so easy. Great. Anyways, enough talking. Let's get those 401 iron ore. That's so sick. If we can get cold next, the smithing grind is going to be piss easy. All right, I'm out of chaos runes, which means we're gonna have to alk, and uh, it's gonna hurt. But alk into dragon long into D mace, it has to happen. What is the alk value on these two? 60k and 30k. <laughs> Woof! All right, getting that big money. I was almost alking this. Holy shit! Dragon longsword. See you later. But this hurts more. This hurts more. The dragon mace. Ouch! We're back. After this one, we're going to do these hard clues. Unlock the brimstone key. Oof, that's fletching XP. That is not bad. Getting another assignment. I am actually leaning towards temple spiders now. For the sole purpose that they drop the pages so I can complete the quest. But then again, I do still need the death runes from the Ankaos. Then again, the temple spiders also drop death runes, so I'm in a bit of a predicament. The temple spiders also drop muddy keys though. But I'm going to do the heart clues first. Because I am running out of chaos runes again. 
and I want to see how much money I can make from like nine hard clues. Super unrelated level, but 60 farming while I was doing my farm run. So, well, farm run, it's literally one farming patch, but you know, 60 farming, that is another task of the league completed. Get our first Raynar Seeds farm too, which is great. Let's keep going with these hard clues. I'm starting to complete them. I'll see you guys when I get all nine completed. I was initially going to wait to open these hard clues and stack them all up. The thing is, I'm killing these wizards with mage and it's just... And I can get a magic shortbow and black di from these hard clues. So I kind of want to change my spellbook to Karen so I can do teleports and kill these wizards quicker with range. So it makes no sense for me to stack them up if... Actual, the actual upgrades to do them quicker is inside the clue themselves. So I'm going to open these four, hoping... Oh my god! That's exactly what I'm fucking talking about. That is exactly what I'm talking about. You are kidding me! You are absolutely kidding me with that clue! Oh my god! I don't even have the race level for it. Well, we have three more to go. I don't know if it can get any better than that, to be honest. That's crazy. Rune Axe too? I didn't even see that. That's incredible. Oh my god. Okay. Three more. Rune Plate Legs, that's an upgrade. Those are some great Alks. Incredible. I think we actually got full Rune now. Oh, where's my Slayer tab? Here it is. That's Rune, Rune, Rune. We just need the Kite Shield and we're done. That's an incredible Alk. Oh, we have the Helmet! I'm blind and excited. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what to do with my life. Uh, we have two more to go. I mean, can it get any better than this? Oh my, absolutely can What is going on? What are these clues? I don't can't even wear it. <laughs> One more, let's get it. Third age. Might as well get the black plate, buddy. Oh my god. Wow. And I have four more to go. Are you boys ready? We have five more heart caskets. What am I looking for? Food to kill my cabbage wizard from heart clues. Uh, monster clues. So, I would love just one chest with about 20, ch 20 sharks. That'd be great. I still need black dehyde legs. And that's kind of it. That's kind of all I still need from heart clues. Another... There we go. Sharks and a great alk. I'm happy with that chest. That is perfect. All right. That's all I need. Let's see what, we, uh, what else we get. That's not a great one. But alks, I'll take it. I'll take it. More Alks, good. That is probably one of the best chests you can get from Elites, because this, I'm um, from Hards, because this is an Elite Clue requirement. And I think I just got my full rune. And a drag, uh, Rune Battle Axe, which is best in slot for raids, because Wooks did it. Okay, lost Hard Clue. Boom. All right, that's trash. Right, so I decided to train my range back up to 50. Just so I can wear a magic shortbow so we can actually try this monster clue. Because without a magic shortbow, there's no way I'm killing this cabbage wizard. I'll see you guys in the next episode when we try this monster clue.